Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Tarek Time, Season 3, Episode 5. This is going to be a little cheeky episode. Um, I'm kind of under the weather, so, well, I have a little bit extra time, so I'm going to support you, or surprise you, not support you, surprise you with an extra episode this week. So I hope you all enjoy. I've got a plan that is going to lead to my death. I can guarantee it. Uh, hi, everybody. Uh, Post-production Tarek here. I just want to insert this into the beginning of the video. Um, while I was filming this, I, I hit 2,000 subs on February 15th. I, I am just so blown away with everybody's support. It is absolutely unreal. I cannot thank you enough for all of your, your kind words, likes, comments, and subs. It, it truly does mean the world to me. And I really, really appreciate everybody's support, so thank you so very much. And now, on with the show. But before we hurry up and go die, um, I'll show you in a second where, here you go. I have a little something prepared here. So I've got some, some stuff prepared here for the episode. Um, I need a diamond sword. And I have two name tags now, which is honestly about time, because, well, Milo... You deserve your name. You are just such a cute face that you deserve to have your name. So, Milo's good to go. And now Mortimer's cute face is all named up as well. Look at you. That rude. Yeah, you, you wag your tail at me. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. Fine. You can just hang out up here, and I'm going to go do my thing, and you can wait there. Real quick before... Or we get this episode completely underway. I need a diamond sword, as I was saying. And I'm quite honestly not looking forward to this because I've pretty much always said that I would never do this. Ever. It's just not worth it. That's actually going to be helpful for this episode if that gives you any idea of what, what we're going to be doing. Down here... In the many, many mine shafts that I discovered right here is a triple cave spider spawner. You hear them already. The, mm -hmm. So, um, drop it in the comments. How many times do you think I'm going to die? I'm thinking like at least eight times I'm going to die during this catastrophe of a thing trying to mine this out and control cave spiders and not get killed by cave spiders. This is going to be terrible, so I'm going to quickly get myself set up here with a bed and stuff, and let's cross our fingers. So, first things first, I need to... I need to torch this to try and stop as many cave spiders spawning as possible. I, I heard you, I see you, I don't like you. Ooh. Was that Bane of Arthropods actually being awesome? Was that a thing? Holy. Okay. Um, I am going to clear a bunch of this out, and then we're going to go find the other two cave spider spawners. In case you noticed, I, I didn't. I hadn't actually uh, set my spawn, so that's set now. And I've got this area dug out correctly, I think think I put water there. No, no. Um, uh, put water there. What's that going to do? Perfect. Okay. But first I need to, the other two are like real close together. And I'm a little more concerned about this one. Because it's in there and in there and just all... All of the badness is right here, and I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Really don't want to get stuck in... Oh, you... See you, I see you, I see you. Ha, gotcha. Okay. Not a fan of this. Not gonna lie. Not a fan of this. Okay, I am going to... Not panic. i panicking. And try and get this cleared out a little bit more off camera. 
I honestly don't know what I was so scared about. I I I don't know. The the last time I encountered cave spiders, I I got absolutely destroyed. And now I'm standing among spawners like no big deal. So I mean I'm getting better at Minecraft. Let's say it isn't so. Um after much trial and error, um water has been placed. This is the easy side. Um the double spawner side was a pain to get this to work properly. So I think we're good now. So no matter where the spiders spawn, they should all eventually make their way over here. Oh, that was exhausting and taxing on my poor little brain. So, but I think that's going to work. Now I just need to do the little kill boxy area thing so um on a momento let me just uh hopefully remember how to do this because it's been a little while it's definitely been a while well here goes nothing that this hopefully actually works that would be spectacular if that was on the first time not getting my hopes up but Oh my goodness, we, we, we can hope, right? We can hope. I'm gonna torchy torch that. Let's go clear up the other one, which is through here, somewhere through here. Okay. Um, we're gonna have to swim and hope that we can outswim the cave spiders. Do, do, do. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. Just, just, just go down there. You want to. You, you want to. Why am I stuck? Okay. Moment of truth. I would say this is moderately successful. Like, it's XP. I'm gonna take it. It's probably flawed a little bit let's um free free camera this and see what's going on so they're getting a little swimmy swimmy there everything's active though so that's this is this is working seriously like it's it's not great here but wow cool um well, I'm gonna sit here for a bit and hopefully not break my diamond sword, but um yeah, we, we need some we need some XPs. Well, I'm not calling it the world's best XP farm, but it's not bad for early games, so I think I can finally go enchant my uh my chest piece and see what we get and Yeah. Hang on, swipe swipe swipey fight. Swipe swipey swipe. Yeah, yeah. And yes, I will have to come back and clean that little area up a little bit later, but right now, I'm not 100% sure how I want to do that, so I'm going to move on to something that I do know how I want to build, which is thankfully up on the surface, because, well, caves and it gets gross. Ugh. But we're going to... Eh. Well, hang on. Ah, back on the surface, in the open air, in the beautiful little area we've got going so far. So, let's uh let me just let, let me just empty my pockets. And now we can make a our first bow. Not that I have a lot of arrows right now, but power three is pretty meh. So let's hope that the chest piece is better. Blast protection. Do I should I? Could I? I mean like it would help with ninja creepers, so I think oh that 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 mm, that was and power three again. Oof. That is a big oof. We're gonna try the chess piece again. Oh, I need more lapis. Come on, something good, something good, something. Ooh, better. Oh. Okay. Well, we're shiny. We're we're shiny. That's that's what's important. Right? Shiny. So in the last episode, we built this well wonderful little fancy 
dark, and I have gone through and added some lighting. Uh, not all of it, because I wasn't sure how we're going to finish over here. But what I do know is I want to build a big old crane over here. So I've got my kind of starter blocks to be able to get a kind of platform and foundation built up. So we'll start with kind of getting that knocked off. And then let's go ahead and build a pretty cool idea for a crane. I'm hoping I can pull it off. It's a little fancy. So freestyling this may be tricky. Perfect. I have a wee little platform here. And it's not just a platform. It's, um, it's very nicely supported as well. That I totally wasn't completely sure I was going to survive that or not, but it worked. I'd say we're off to a very good little start. Definitely need to add, you know, a little bit of greenery around here as well, just to kind of keep it in tune with what's going on. But I'd say we have a solid start. Now I'm going to go collect some stuff for the, uh, the, 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 the lifty thing. The crane. That's the word. Oh my. Okay, so the rough idea for the crane is I want to have kind of like a A-frame on both sides, the main boom arm going up on a 45, and then also on a two-step with a couple of big wheels on the sides. Does that make sense? It makes sense in my brain. Hopefully it kind of made sense for you. So now we can try and build it. So I think that's going to work for like the little a framey thing because yeah hopefully 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 so now need to well i need to get a boom arm in place so let's let's see where this ends up so here would be the middle of the warehouse so you know, the theory is that, you know, somebody could hook the chain, pull it in, and then they'd kind of attach it to a log, and it would be lifted and dragged out and then dropped down. I just need to get this to connect to that in a nice fashion. And I'm thinking iron? I don't know if it's going to be, like, connected the hallway, or if we're going to do the little cheater joints where you do that is that okay probably not hmm let's I, i'm gonna find out where this where where this ends up so i'd say we're off to a, a better start now um i've changed out the main boom arm to acacia because it was just too much brown but the Iron bars are not cutting it. I think I'm gonna have to like go to like a maybe a dark oak fence kind of situation. I think that will be better. Couple of tweaks there again. Swapped out the spruce uh, stairs for some copper. Once that oxidizes, it'll be a little more contrasty to the boom, which I think will look better. So now I just need to figure out a wheels on both sides and i'm not 100 percent sure to be honest with you so i think we're gonna we're gonna do some sculpty sculpting with some dirt because that usually helps my brain um i'm trying to figure out how we're gonna kind of make this shape here so i don't know why but i think that's gonna work there so now i just need to well make it not dirt because the dirt's ugly. And yes, I'm using diorite, which is going to make a bunch of you um, upset. And unfortunately, that entertains me, so you're welcome. I would say that's a pretty cool-looking wheel. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Now I just need to make it again on the other side. And we should be off to... Well, I don't know, the races finishing-ish something? I, I don't know. Okay, uh, I've made a handful of little tweaks. So I've, the boom arm has been changed to deep slate tile just to give it a little bit more contrast. It was just blending in too much. I got a little bit of a rope with a log hooked up to the end there. And then for the actual A-frame, I actually took that and spread it out a little bit. Um, 
it was originally kind of uh, with only one block in between, but it just made the whole thing look really tippy. So kind of spread that out, give it a little bit more structure there. So I really like how that has turned out. But now I, I really want to see what this looks like with the oxidized copper. So I think I'm going to go spend some time down at the spider spawner and try and get myself a bunch of levels. And hopefully this, uh, this oxidizes in that time. Okay, I have been down here for quite some time, and I even resurfaced for a little bit, and I actually went and re-chanted my chest, which is now way better. Don't really need the thorns, but it happened, and I got respiration on a helmet. Oh, thank you. And then I tried re-enchanting re my pants and boots and got diddly, so we're gonna go fix that. Oh, 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 and I did a second sword, which turned out to be amazing. And I combined it with the first sword, and now I have this amazing sword. I just need, like, a mending. Like, th this is the perfect spider spawner sword. I was so happy. I probably should have recorded it, but I didn't. So, mm, yeah, sorry. But now, I am going to quickly go re-enchant my boots and uh, legs to see if we can get something a little bit better. And then we're going to go check on the copper on that uh, crane there. Okay, and while we're at it, while we have a whole bunch of levels, we are going to try and get infinity. A very strong start, I'll take it, but I don't need a second flame bow, so what do we got in the pants? Okay. Death Strider 3. Uh, no, no. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Power 3. Okay. No. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Come on. Better. At least we can combine those two. I just need to get infinity on something, and I will be set. Ooh. We, let, we love to see that. Come on. No, 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 no. One more try here. Power four, and I'm breaking. I already have I'm breaking, so we're going <sighs> to... That's more like it. Prod four, I'm breaking three. That that those are some nice pants. Now, I just am gonna keep enchanting this bow until it gives me infinity, or I run out of levels. One or the other. And I ran out of levels. Oh well, we're we are off to a much better start. I still don't have a decent supply of arrows, because well. I really want to find a skeleton spawner. That would be amazing, but I've been unable to do so. Found a, well, the triple cave spider spawner and like four zombie spawners. But yeah, arrows, bones, bone meal, that is all going to be amazing. But now, let's go check on that copper. Well, a little, little bit of progress. Not as much as I was hoping, but it's, it's, it's coming along. It's coming along. You are slacking. Oh well. Um, yeah, I really like this. This is so cool. Let's, let's quickly just do a little, a little, a little free camera mod action. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. Look at that beautiful little air. Look at this. Oh, it's so cool. I love it. I love it so very much. So very much. But folks, I'm going to wrap up this episode. It's been a lot of fun. We have an amazing source of XP now. Yes, it's actually amazing. It's, it's. I know I doubted it, and I didn't die. That was the amazing part. We didn't die once. We actually haven't died yet in this world, which is weird. But I probably jinxed it now, so... But that's fine. Um, but yeah, thank you so very much for coming out. Thank you for all of the, the subs, the likes, the, the comments. It's been absolutely mind-blowing. I've had just a roller coaster of two weeks, and I can't thank you folks enough, so thank you. And until next time, folks, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.